I'm being thing. forcibly removed from the building again of a public lobby. So. so if you want to take off that gun and badge, I'm happy to scrap with you one day. Sir, please, is there anything I can do, sir, please? Don't do this to my wife, man. You don't know what you're doing to my family, man. Please, I'm begging. I'm literally begging. Where am I going to put my feet? Sir, I'm begging you, please. Please. You want to do it, You let's do it. Let me know, buddy. That is not a crime, and you're telling me to get out of my vehicle. Do you know where Lieutenant Mingus is right now? So, no, he's not in the building? I don't know. I'm not. What do you know? Okay, I don't want that man taking my picture. Uh, Why sir, don't you take him out of here? Sir, you hit me. I'm a you hit enough. me. Okay, sir, okay now you take my picture, then. I don't know you. I'm not telling you nothing else until I find out who's driving that vehicle. You not a supervisor, bro. I need somebody higher than you right now. I didn't break the law. I'm not going to be found guilty of anything. This is a waste of time. If you guys want to know who I am, I'll tell you who I am. Okay. You want to know what I'm doing here? I'll tell you what I'm doing here. Uh, if you didn't know, I went to the police academy and they kicked me out. That's my purse! I don't know you! Spit me on my face right now! She spit in my face! Please, sir, please don't make me sleep in jail. I'm begging you. We're sir, not criminals! Please. They're going to make me sleep in jail. Why? Sir, please. Please, dude, please. Oh, my God, don't do that to him. You guys don't know what you're doing to me, man. Why? Why are you saying right here? Oh, man. You guys really don't know what you're doing to my life with this, man. Seriously, please. We really haven't been getting a lot of support from the community. Um, You know, we need help getting hotels. Uh, we've pretty much got the food and gas covered, but if there's any way anyone can help out in any way, guys, the hotels, uh, the fees have really been killing us. Um, you know, we don't make a, a million dollars. We don't make a whole lot of money. But if there's any way anyone can help out, please, we couldn't do it without you guys. Today's video takes us to Columbia, South Carolina, where we find a fraudster who thinks it's his absolute right to film at a polling precinct. Even though there's signs up everywhere that say no recording or photographs permitted. Woo wee. Well, the sheriff's deputies are called and he has a couple of go rounds with them, all to no avail. And in the end, he says his camera was assaulted. Oh my goodness gracious. Well, sit back, watch, and <laughs> enjoy. Hi. Oh, is that right? Yeah. Is that a law? Yes, it is. It's a law. You can't okay. have it. We have it posted on there. Yeah, well, if that was a law, there'd be a statute on there. We have it posted, sir. Can you show me the statute? Yes. Can okay. you sure. leave out without your phone? Because no. we have voters. You right. can't have no pictures around here. Well, that, that's, that's not a law, unfortunately. Yes, it is. No, it's not. It is, sir. Well, can you show it, it to is. me? Let me get the director. Yeah, but get you the have director. to step out, though. You, you, I, I don't care about him filming us, but That's right. you can't film all of these voters you, can around you, here. Can you tell her what the law is? Okay. Who are you, Ms. Terry? Mr. Terry? What's your name, hon? We put it in, uh, yeah, film, put it in there. I'll tell him your name. I'm Nancy Sakai. Do you work here? all of their rights. No. Yeah. You're trying to violate my rights. I'm not violating your rights. You You're trying. Report. That is a law. You're trying. That is a law. Okay, so there's a sign clearly posted on the door that the idiot zoomed in on before he walked inside that says no pictures or recordings allowed. He wants to push the envelope, so this is a really long video. I'm going to try to keep it as short as possible because he just drags it out for about 45 minutes. We don't need to see all that nonsense, so I'll be cutting quite a bit out. Bear with me. 15 minutes later. I've already waited in line. So what? They told you to stay out there and, and when, and like all these other good people did, when, they, when you called them in. I did that already. I've already been in this line. You no, and did you no, call the deputies on me, and I stepped outside to no, talk to them. And you're going to have to step outside the door again and wait till your turn. That's not what the deputy said. What the deputy tell me? They know the law. What did they? That's tell what you, you need to learn. What did they tell you? The law is. We're not going. I'm, I'm, I'm they're done. law enforcement. They're law enforcement. You're done. Okay. You're done. Okay. 
So, so what told, are you saying? No, are, you're not going to let me vote? No, sir. You're not letting me vote. You're not letting yourself vote. I'm putting a formal complaint in on dis- you. You're being disrupted. These people here no, want you out of the you body. are being disruptive. Team. You're being disruptive. Okay. All right. So there you heard it. Now, you don't think the fraud is going to give up that easily, do you? Certainly not. He's going to go back in and he's going to assert his rights, no doubt about it. You deny my access to vote? You cannot report me. And who are you, ma'am? I'm good. What's your name, ma'am? What's your name? Is Terry telling you that? How come you're not educating your employees? You've had this long to learn the law and you in election day and you still don't know it. You can't just make up your own laws here. You have to follow state law. And you're trying to violate my rights to vote. I've never heard of any potato cam being allowed into a voting precinct anywhere. The only exception that I ever saw to that was Long Island Frauditor. He was allowed to record himself voting after he cried for about an hour to the police. Yeah, I don't know any place, though, that you're allowed to take your camera in and just record everything you see. Five minutes later. Sir, no, you cannot record us. This is, this is an employee area, and this is off guards. No okay. cell phones okay. at the counter. Okay, read that. Ma'am, can I get your name? No cell phones. Can I get your name? You cannot record me, but I'm going to tell you right now. Can I get your no name? No cell phones. And do not record. Yes, thank you, Shaka. It's okay, I can record you. you can record me. I yes, ma'am, you're a public servant. Oh, that's battery. Did I hit you? You touched my camera and my. You put it in my did y'all see that? Oh, come on now, I got it on recording. Your employee just battered me. See, you got these kids. See, you're letting you this get out of kids. control you because you don't know the law. You, know not act you don't know the law, and you're letting your employees batter somebody. Well, at least the moron didn't claim he was assaulted. And I don't think he was battered either. I think his camera was battered. But you can't assault or batter an inanimate object. So, I don't know, man. Shut your mouth, frauditor. Soon after. You're in public. This is not, this is. This is public. No recording allowed this is public. That's not lawful. If that, if that was lawful, there'd be a statute. Just so you know. There is a statute. Look, show it to me because <laughs> there's not one. Trust me, I know. I looked it up. There's no uh, reasonable expectation of privacy in public. So when you go outside your door. Well, I'm asking you politely to please not. Okay, well, then I'll respect your, poli- your privacy. Get it off of me. I will, but I'm telling you, I don't have to. I've asked you politely you- to move the camera off of me. Well, I'm not. I'm trying to vote here. Okay, well, I'll give you your you're privacy. Intimidating me. No, I'm not. Yes, you are. No, I'm not. No. Yes, you are. You're intimidating. Government corruption. Government corruption. Government corruption. I'm trying to vote. 
Okay, I'm not punching. I'm trying to exercise my right to vote. Okay, you're not you're on my camera. You're interfering me and you're interfering nope. with all of those other individuals. I'm only recording public no, officials. I'm here to record them because you're of... You're intimidating me. No. I'm trying to vote and you're intimidating me. No, sir. Yes. No, I'm not here to record I, voters. I'm trying to vote and I feel intimidated. You're not being intimidated. I feel intimidated by this. No, I'm, I'm here to keep to government accountable. How do you keep government accountable by telling everybody you can't trespass my eyes? You were in public. There's no expectation of privacy in public. How do you keep a government accountable like that? Yeah. Oh, my head hurts so bloody bad from these idiots. Ten minutes later. How are you doing? Can I get your name? Burroughs? Did I say that right? Nice to meet you. Did you see the battery that occurred? You were standing right there. The lady grabbed my phone. I know if somebody grabbed your phone, I'm sure you would arrest them, right? Oh, we got a cam back. No, they stopped the line. No, they stopped the line. No, no, this is government corruption right here. And well, I give a damn. Well, this is my government, and I don't like corruption. No, they they closed it. You can take it home. I can be here just like you can. You can. You want to record me? How are you going to say you didn't? Bullshit, this bitch ass quacker right here stopped the whole motherfucking line for nothing. Nope. They did. Yes, did. No, they did. All these right fucking there. people out there. They did. Why are you intimidating and voting? I'm not intimidating. The news is on the way to you. Don't worry. Okay, right. yeah. Did you Everybody's got a camera. Excuse me. Wait, thank you, you for. Can you read? Yeah, no, I can read. Okay, read. Can you read what this says? Okay, show me the statue. Can you say what this says? Show me the statue. Frontier, if I were you, I'd shut my mouth. But I'm not you, and you won't shut your mouth. But you got some angry women there. They'll give you a smack down quicker than a man ever would. Better be careful there, Frontier. He stupid. How you doing? Doing good. How you doing? All uh, right, you got some rank here. Okay. Sure. They fill you in what's going on? Yeah, they okay. told me a little bit of you. Why don't you tell me your side of it? Well, I, I really don't have a side. I'm just a private citizen keeping government accountable. And um, I guess we, we all know the government corruption that happened here in 2012, the partisan corruption, and I'm just here to hold them accountable, make sure they got the right number of machines. Um, <clears throat> and the employees are trying to make it out that I'm here to intimidate voters, which I'm absolutely not. I'm, <coughs> excuse me, I'm not here to record ballots. Right. And that's what the law is. You can't record your ballot. You can't record anybody else's ballot. But you can record anything else. You can record the machines. You can record the government people, mm -hmm. government uh, public servants. Mm -hmm. You can record the people, although I'm not here to record them unless they point a camera at me and then I point it back at them. Mm -hmm. You know, that's kind of but um, that's all I'm here doing. And the director... Um, told me to leave and so that's a that's a violation of my right to vote as i sit here and edit these videos each and every day i often wonder how this nonsense got started who was the first fraud editor who picked up a potato cam and went out there and made money on it yeah there's a lot of old time fraud editors out there but i wonder who was the first now i just want the lady's name you want to vote? I want to vote, but I want her name first. I mean, do you want to vote? A few moments later. Okay, can we get this gentleman? Uh, he want to vote. He claimed he want to vote. Mm -hmm. um, so, uh, we want to vote. We don't, we don't want to. You know, that's his right. So, uh, if you want to vote, uh, get him in the room. So, you, you, you going to allow me to vote? Um, I need the three employees' names. They're wearing name badges. Why is that a problem? Yeah, I got That's that. a problem. I got it. I got it. I got it. If you want to vote, you can vote. They need your ID. Right. I know that I know the vote. You have to show a picture ID. 
but they're not IDing themselves, so why should I ID myself? I don't even know what that means. Were you here in 2012? I'm here now. I know, but are you from here? You like you were in the military. Were you ex-military? You ever notice how frauditors never answer questions, but they sure like to ask them, don't they? Yeah, frauditor, you keep on asking questions because I don't think you're going to get too many more answers. Eventually. Okay, you can't go in there. I can't. Nope. Why not? Nope, they don't. They don't want you. So you're going well, to step back out. Is that a lawful order? Huh? Is that a lawful order? It's not. I know they don't want me here. I don't want to be assaulted and battered. So I need her name. You give me a lawful order to leave, I'll leave. I'm not gonna resist. I'm gonna step over here out of the way of the door. Can I step over here out of the way of the door? Are you impeding my, my movement? I'm gonna step over here to the exit door. Give me some space. Yeah, I don't wanna get the voters. It would be apparent to just about anyone, even those with a pea-sized brain, that you're not welcome inside this voting precinct. But, of course, you have to understand that frauditors have no common sense. None at all. So he's going to continue to stay inside. So what, what are we doing, Cooper? <laughs> sir, you got some names for me? No, sir. Uh, I thought you were getting some names. No, that's not a good, no, that don't make you look good. That don't make you look. He's doing good. He talks. He wanted to take my complaint. He wanted to take my report. He's doing his job. And you got rank. I have a right to be here. I have a right not to be battered. So what are you doing? Well, if I'm not getting names, I'm getting out of here. So are you just going to follow me around? This is the first smart thing the frauditor has done this entire video. But he's not quite finished yet because someone with higher rank is going to arrive. He's just a bloody idiot. You know, he needs a real smackdown. He's supposed to be a man, but he's not. He's a little boy in a man's body. I could have remained silent and not told you anything, but as a courtesy to you, as a deputy I respect, I told you why I was here. And then you're going to play the silent game on me. It's your duty to explain the law to these people. And you're just standing out here like a lump on a log. Blocking the door. Hey, how you doing? Well, how you doing? Pretty good. Hey, hey, what's going on? Can I get your name, sir? Sergeant Barrett. Sergeant Barrett. Yes. Got some rank here. I was just explaining to these deputies here while I was here. Okay. Um, and they don't seem to want to talk. They're playing a silent game on me. I told them it don't make them look good. When we, we're going to work, so you can. Get yeah, I know. I can hang out in there. I can hang out in, out here. I can hang out in there too, Sergeant.
Well, now there you have it, folks. I guess the lad didn't get the vote, and he didn't get to find out if there's any government corruption in there today. Oh, stupid idiot this guy is. Yeah, that video was about 47 minutes long, and I tried to cut it down as much as I possibly could. Yeah, what are you going to do? These frauditors just ramble on and on. But at any rate, if you enjoy watching idiots, imbeciles, and morons on my channel, please subscribe. As always, thanks so much for stopping by. Mm hmm. Cheers to that. Oh, you assaulted me. I did. Sue me. You assaulted me. She assaulted me. Oh, oh no. Yo, you're racist. Katie. Racist. Oh, oh. that's a hate crime. You're being disorderly. Oh, call the police. Call the police. Call the police. I'm not sitting down. I refuse to sit down. I refuse. Big tough guy. Big tough guy. Big tough guy. What are you gonna do about it? Nothing. Nothing. You can come try to make me. You're welcome to try to make me. Take a swing. Take a swing. What is the reason for calling the officers here? You're going to jail, bro. Go ahead, put Stop your hands on me. me, bro. Put your hands on me. Really, no reason I'm really, to have. I'm really, I'm really unhappy that somebody did this to me. I'm gonna arrest you for trespassing in a minute. On public property? Yeah. We're asking you to leave, and you're not leaving. That's trespassing. She's, jealous. she's right in my face, guys. You, you just assaulted me, man. You can't t come up and touch me like that. You don't have permission to film me in any space. I don't need permission to yes, you record do. you in public, man. Actually, no, that's the do. law. Salam yalla handula, alu akbar. Hagnuikan da kra, ulawala fufatai.